Euphorbia trigona is an easy care succulent that originates from Central Africa. Although it looks like a cactus, it is actually a succulent. Also known as the African milk tree because of its milky sap contained in the stems, it makes a fascinating architectural addition to room designs with its upright stems and ridges of short-lived leaves and thorns. African milk tree is an attractive plant that stems and leaves flushed red to magenta. The, are off, the stems are often greener for a lovely bicolored look. They are with three to four ridges and V-shaped lighter patterns. Spines are reddish brown, long and arranged in pairs of on the ridges. Leaves grown between the two spines on each ridge. These plants require a little pampering to become established, but once they are, they are self-sufficient. In fact, more die from too much care and watering than from neglect. African milk tree needs well-draining soil and lots of sunlight. Just like all other succulents, growing African milk trees is easiest in a sandy, fast-draining soil. They aren't particular about pH, so giving them a good home is pretty easy. Good companion plants include flapjacks, fire stick pencil plant, jay plant, and desert rose. As with many other euphorbia species, the latex from the plant is poisonous and can cause skin irritations. It is a pest-free plant. A problem that some trigonias face is that they are susceptible to falling over when fully grown because of their shallow and small root system.